If the child never separates from the mother, there's an invisible bind, a vector of desire that will be traversed with any friend, lover, or authority figure. The child never separates with the mother. There will constantly be that umbilical relationship with every person real, symbolic, and imaginary. If the child never separates from the mother, the child will always be abandoned, always be searching. And never a calm baby. Never a lullaby that can soothe the inside. If the child never separates from the mother, then there is a diagram of desire that's inscribed upon every interaction the child is thus to experience. And yet, we all must separate from our mothers. We all must leave the womb. We all must leave her home. We must leave her side. She will eventually experience her own separation anxiety. As at a time, the mother experiences a relationship with the infant that is insurmountable to anything else. The sound of the baby crying she can identify from yards off. The sound of the baby's crying can release breast milk in her breasts. The sound of her baby moving in the crib. She's immediately alert and rushes to its side. The mother becomes a machine in this inscription of desire. She herself becomes the infant. <laughs> 